Guys, I'm coming at you from the blue obelisk, or at least the big old toppled over blue obelisk that somehow we flew past yesterday without even spotting. Guys, I have found a, uh, I guess a new region on this map that we had never before encountered. Even yesterday, as we flew around the map and, uh, you know, explored new places and tried to unlock some new, new regions and whatnot, uh, we missed this. Completely and utterly missed this. Hidden out here beyond the snowy depths of this world lies a land that well to be quite frank uh, i'm quite glad that i came across because it's this uh yeah <laughs> i never thought i'd see that oh great now we got argy's coming for us i'm not prepared for no argy's be gone my friends uh, but yeah it seems that this map does have a volcano that happens to cross over with i guess I don't really know what to call this area, but um, I guess it's a volcanic region uh, with Rexes and Karchars and Gigas and 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 Argies and um, these kind of lightning wyvern thingamabobbies. I don't know. Uh, what's this called? A shadow wyvern. Get a load of that one right there. But welcome back, everybody. Welcome back to our docks over hardcore mega modded series um, where today... I mean, we'll, we'll get to today. For now, though, I need to show you this place. Um, it is, I guess, where the snow and the volcano meets. Um, I've been kind of just heading around here for a little bit. Um, for some reason, it didn't really show up on the map. But uh, yeah, well, I'm so glad we found this because this is like a... It's a haven for, for strong dinosaurs that eventually I'm sure we're going to want to tame <laughs> um we do obviously seek quite frequently uh alpha rexes alpha gigas alpha karchars uh not to mention alpha argies which is probably something i'm i'm still kind of lacking on also hi uh oh it's only a level 20 but it seems the map actually has uh i don't know if it was in a recent update that this was introduced um they got some like i guess local uh uh, what do you call these uh wyverns i guess um map specific map living i don't know um but they obviously belong on this map which is pretty sweet because we do not have access to wyverns just yet i also just saw this a pygmy carno cute i have no need for one right this second but cute nonetheless i thought maybe it was going to be a uh well i'm still keeping my eyes open for like pygmy lord kongs and pygmy uh Lord Dodecuruses, because they seem to, well, from what I understand, be quite useful beings. Um, but these wyverns, unfortunately, are quite low level. I would have picked up that egg if it was a little bit of a higher level than whatever it was, 20 or 60 or 40, whatever it was that we just saw. But uh, unfortunately, not. Now, if I do see an egg lying around for one of these wyverns, that's a little bit of a higher level. Damn, that is level 840. Then I will stop and pick it up. But... Um, I also kind of don't want to be pursued by one of those wyverns because they kind of look kind of dangerous. And judging by the amount of dead body bags that were lying around that one, we were just looking at a second ago. Uh, well, yeah, it's they're, they're clearly very aggressive <laughs> wyverns. Um, that I I probably shouldn't be picking a fight with, to be honest. Especially since we really do not have a lot of flyers at our disposal, or at least not a lot of strong ones. Anyways, now that we've ventured out here, it's going to allow more of these, these strong dinosaurs to spawn uh, for us to come out and p potentially tame. Um, so that's pretty darn sweet. We can now head back to base and I can... Ooh, it looks like there's a mega nearby as well. We can head back to base and I can show you what I've been working on since last episode. So, as you know by now, we've been breeding together a ton of strong dudes. We got we got Carnos coming out of our butt. We got this big fella, Mega Alpha Rex, who yesterday we fed a corrupted DNA strand, uh, which made it super quick, I think. It now has, like, ridiculous speed. Uh, unfortunately, its damage is down, but it is really good in the damage reduction department. Now, our Carnos, on the other hand, are quite interesting. I'd never really paid attention to these guys' buffs that they've got and whatnot. Uh, but I got to show you something pretty darn fascinating. Our original Mega Alpha Kano over here. This guy has insane buffs. Tough, brawler, brawler, balanced. Fragile is unfortunately quite terrible. Balanced, weak is bad. That's fine. Runner, runner, tough, and juggernaut on the Mega Upgrade. Juggernaut is the most uncommon but most desired trait of the bunch especially on the mega upgrade um this guy's actually a beast 
20% extra damage, 23% extra speed. This guy's not even corrupted yet. Um, and 68% or 32% damage reduction. This guy's a machine. Like, like an insane machine. The only downside is it's level 467, where the rest of our squad are all like level, you know, 900s and thousands and just absolute butt whoopers. So we obviously had a bunch of, uh, or a whole pile of Kanos over here, which I slowly split up into, I guess, different groups. I've gone and moved a bunch of them down there. They had quite bad traits on them. Uh, and I'm pretty sure what remains over here are actually pretty decent. Our prime alpha over here is Brawler, Runner, Weak. So like mostly positive, a lot of tough, a lot of runners, but the stats wise, good speed, good damage and damage reduction. This guy needs to, I need to evolve this like, like ASAP type of thing. Cause this thing might be an absolute machine. And due to us killing a bunch of stuff recently, we can do that pretty easily. Uh, we can end up with a good old squad of megas basically, which might be what we need to do to take down, I guess our very first Lord boss, which is coming up pretty soon, I think. So. Let's go and drop this mega string in and it's just balanced. Wow, that's really disappointing. That's a terrible up. <laughs> I was hoping for better, but hey, good speed. To be honest, it's not terrible. And then we're going to go and feed it the corrupt genetic string, which is going to do what? What's it going to be on? Speed. It's always speed. I keep getting speed. So this cardo is going to move fast. <laughs> oh, it's quick. This thing is has a 40% speed buff, which is nuts. Um, in fact, this guy's really, really good. All right, you're, gonna, you're definitely like right up front as far as my team goes now. So I am happy with that. It would have been nice to get like a Juggernaut upgrade, but I'll take it. Um, as far as our existing, I guess our main guy over here, this Mega Kano, uh, this guy's buffs, now that I'm thinking about it, not as good. Okay, we, we now have a new primary... Uh, Mega, which is this guy to my right. Lower level overall, but absolute machine. Anyways, let's get on to the rest of these guys because I'm pretty sure all the ones that we've got left over here are pretty good. This guy here is Brawler Tough Runner. So like all positive traits. That guy could potentially uh, become something quite magical. This one, Tough Tough Runner Brawler Balanced. Another, like this one's actually fantastic. In fact, this one here might be the next one that I decide to uh, level up and evolve. We've then got sterile. Okay, this is where things get interesting, okay? This is where things get really interesting. I'm going to look at this one in just a second with you, but... Oh, wait, this is just a regular Kano here. Oh, you're on the scrap heap. All right, come over here, buddy. Uh, this is what I keep missing as well. Uh, we, we hatch eggs, and then either a Kano or an Alpha can come out of it. Um, and then I sometimes forget that, and this guy's just a regular Kano. But this guy, our sterile friend... Um, have a look at this. So... It, uh, it has the runner trait, so it doesn't have many traits, unfortunately. But it's got the sterile trait, which I didn't realize is a buff type of thing, which gives it 15% damage reduction, or at least that's what it says. Um, although it's, it doesn't show on here, so I, I'm, I'm, I don't know how this works. I'll be honest, but I've never seen that on anything before. That 15%. So that's interesting. I don't know if that means that this thing has damage reduction, but it's still pretty cool and could be very helpful. So this one's kind of on the maybe pile. Um, you, did we look at you yet? Brawler Tough Runner, another beast. Another lot of potential on this one here. So come over here, my friend. Not quite as good as our friend here to the right, but great nonetheless. You two are my megas. I'm, I really got to start like naming these guys to split them up a little bit. Brawler and Tough. Okay, that guy's good. Uh, this one here is just a brawler. We're basically looking for ones that have multiple. This guy's a brawler. This guy's balanced and brawler. So you do good damage, good damage reduction, good speed. This guy's really good, actually. Yeah, you're good. And then this one, balanced, weak, and brawler. You're actually, I mean, not great, but not terrible either. All right, you come over here as well. So we've got a few here that I think need a bit of a bump up. Um, and I'm hoping that we can compile a good team of maybe, I don't know, I don't know how many. Maybe, I, we probably don't even need many of them. Um, that can all come out with us and we can just absolutely annihilate everything in our path. That's basically what I'm thinking here. I, and I think it's, it's going to work. I think it's going to be a pretty cool thing uh, once we get this thing going. So I'm going to bring a bunch of these genetic strings with me. Uh, we're going to leave our megas at home for today. I'm going to bring you, you... And you, I guess, because these are the three that seem to have quite a bit of potential. Um, and then we are going to head out. I was going to go to the mid-desert. Uh, looks like we're going to bring old Sterile with us too, which 
You know what? Not the end of the wall. Nope, Stero didn't make it in. Fair enough. Um, and we're going to quickly... Actually, I forgot. i got to give these guys some... some hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm going to give these guys some extra buffs. I just remembered. So, this guy right here is on runner, brawler. Okay, this guy only needs one more bump up. And it got brawler. I'll take that. That's pretty good. Okay. You have... You need three. You need three of these. Okay, this is the one that I'm hoping does good as well. Tough. That's good. Um, these superior genetic strings, by the way, they have a higher chance of giving a good buff, which is why we kind of like seeing these ones here or using these ones at least. Uh, we got tough runner and brawler. That's good. And now that it's got three upgrades, it's, uh, it can turn into a unique after a couple kills. And then this guy, unfortunately, I don't have enough genetic strings. So we're going to have to get this guy a few. He just picked up tough, which is pretty darn sweet. All right, let's go. Now, we do need to be fighting stronger dinosaurs to get these guys. I've got a Microraptor on my tail. Are you kidding me? I think we might have outrun it, so that's good. Man, there's a few of them out here. We do need to be fighting big, strong guys to get what we need. That is a corrupt prime. That will absolutely annihilate me. We've got a regular Bronzo over there. <laughs> Sorry, I'm trying to dodge this from happening. You absolute pest. Arr, we almost got away with it, too. That's so annoying. I hate getting stunned by micro raptors. It's just, it's just, it's just dangerous. Uh, but yeah, we do need to find some alphas out here. Uh, and the way it works is you're more likely to get the genetic string drops and, and power ups and turn into a unique by killing dinosaurs that can kind of damage you back. So we're looking for Karchars. We're looking for, I guess, I think Brontos actually pass as well. Um, that's a prime Bronto with a lot of health. I might be able to take that down. These guys aren't necessarily weak. They're actually quite strong. Dude, a prime Bronto might be where it's at. Also, my Brontos are still kind of stuck in the ground for some reason. I don't know why. It's it's bizarre. Um, all right, you know what? Yeah, let's go. Yeah, we can take this on. And we'll take down this little friend here as well. Why not? All right, everybody get in there. Let's, let's annihilate this thing. See if we can get some uniques out of this. Oh, snap. One of them already is. Wait, one of them just turned. Wait, killing this. Wait, what? I didn't even kill anything. Why are you a unique already? That's amazing. Don't get me wrong. I'm, I'm, I'm very happy about that, but we didn't kill anything. <laughs> That's amazing. That's so good. All right, all right, all right. Yeah, we're doing this. The big question is going to be, though, can a pack of these guys take down, well, a King Kong? King Dodecurus, Lord Dodecurus, whatever they're called, because that's what we need them to be able to do. If I need to use 10 of these guys, I will. If we got to get them their prime and mega upgrades, we will. But yeah, I don't know. Uh, it's I, I, I do worry that we're going to like lose the entire team along the way. All right, well done. I think we actually got two genetic strings out of that. Dude, that's perfect. Uh, so was it you who didn't get the buffs? Yep. Okay, this guy here now gets... Two of his extra buffs. He got an extra tough. So this guy's getting damage reduction upgrades. Left, right, and center. And runner, which unfortunately I think drops its damage a little bit. But it gets faster, so that's good. Okay, uh, so you're unique. I can turn you into a prime and then a mega. Is this going to break your health though is the question. Because what ha what seems to happen is when I upgrade or when I, when I bump these guys up to primes. Oh, hold on. Hello. You need kind of guys help me out here. When we when we turn our squad into primes, uh, we t they tend to like drop health, and it's a little bit annoying. Um, I don't know. Yeah, it's a little bit annoying. I guess their health increases, and then as a result, oh, there's a pygmy alpha raptor. We got a prime raptor pygmy just the other day. Um, but yeah, once they lose their health, they kind of become well. They got to heal up, and that takes a little bit of time. So. A little bit unfortunate, but yeah, I'm, I'm, I'll try and get all these guys to unique before we do that. Um, what's with the tracks kind of charging in here too? You know what? Let's everybody, everybody get in there. Just take everything down, man. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Come on. If we can get all these guys to unique and fast, I'd be so happy. I just wish I knew how the first one turned into a unique. Because I want to, I want, I, well, yeah, I mean, we could speed up the process for the remainder. Um, really not trying to fight these Triceratopses, though. This guy... Oh, hello. 
Alpha Alright. Yeah, that'll do. And there's also a Prime Patchy. Beautiful. Alpha some primes. That's what we want. Except not like corrupted ones. Those corrupted ones really kind of damaged us last adventure and things went a little bit not so great. But it is what it is. All right. Oh, Prime Patch is in here too. All right. We got this right, right? We got this. Yeah. Oh, great. My guy over there is like 1v1ing a track and potentially getting his bot whooped. Go, 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 go. I just hit a Bronto on as well. All right. Come here, come here, come here. Gotcha. I'm still not a unique. My team over here. We still got like, it's just the one of them. The other two are not yet. All right. Well. It's all good. My guy's here okay. Yeah, they're pretty damaged. Dude. Oh, I just thought one of them was about to die, but I think that was my guy's health. Oh, poor little baby Bronto. Sorry, my guy. But wrong place at the wrong time. A little fresh. You'd totally just claim me and bring you home. But too bad. All right. Let's have a look at our team here. How are we doing? Still just the one unique. We got this guy. He's a little bit banged up. We got this guy. All right. Let's give you a... Let's evolve you. Let's see what, see what you can turn into for me. Here is your prime string. Bam. Balanced. That's not what I was hoping for. And because why not? Let's go and turn you into a mega as well. I think I'm is about to bite me. I was going to say, I, I can, yep. <laughs> I had the feeling I was about to get attacked. Oh, hello. I thought you died. All righty. Where did he go? Just under here. All right, um, Mega String. Oh, dude, you got 31 levels up your sleeve too? All right, three, two, one, and go. Juggernaut! Yes, he got the good upgrade. That gives him crazy stats, I'm pretty sure. So now he's dealing 30% extra damage. He's got like 38% damage. Yeah, this thing's a machine. Oh, that's a good one. That might be it. That might, that might even replace our previously best uh, Kano. Oh, that's amazing. That's so good. All right. Um, I probably shouldn't have put all those levels into health. But that's fine. It is what it is. Uh, unfortunately, can't do anything with the remaining two just yet, though. So these guys are going to need a little bit more, well, killing, I guess. You guys coming or what? All right. Let's fight some raptors, I guess. <laughs> okay. Uh, we are heading to, oh, let's go to, let's go to the red obelisk and we'll see what we can find out there. See if there's any like, I don't know, I hope there's like a pack of, yeah, pretty much that, a Bronto. Sweet. Is it, oh, if it was an alpha, it would have been like amazing, but unfortunately not. Um, there we go. All right. Let's go and attack the big fella over here. Wait. Why does it look a little different? Oh, okay. No, never mind. I've just like lost my bearings a little bit. That's fine. Oh, nice. We got some. Oh, we got. What's that? Prime Triceratops. Oh, can we do it? We're so low on health. I'm a little nervous about this one. I'm going to ask my squad to just stay back. This might trigger. Whoa. <laughs> he's so quick. Oh, he's so fast. All right. Hold on. There's a lot of tracks around here. So if we start to get, yep, that's what I was worried about. That's what I was worried about. Oh no. Oh no. Get in here guys. Help me out. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Yep. 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 Help us out. Help us out. Okay. Thankfully my guy's got plenty of health. It's the other two that are a little bit damaged. Uh, <laughs> oh my goodness. Uh, that was a terrible idea. All right. We're good. We haven't lost anyone. Have we? I hope not. I hope not. I hope not. Uh, we're good. You know what? I should probably get my guys out of here. Get out of here, guys. Run, run, run for your lives. Run for your lives. I got this. I can finish this off. It's just a single unique Triceratops and some babies. Uh, never mind. We got we got a few more coming. Or well, just one coming. Let me dodge out of the way of that one there. All right. All right. We got this. <laughs> oh, that was insane. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Okay. 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 There we go. All right. Still no unique upgrades for either of my guys, unfortunately. Uh, but, hey, everybody's alive. So... That's good. We also, oh, it's a corrupt prime. All right, how are my guys going? Hold on a second, because this is like, this is one of those, this is one of those moments I, I, I should take advantage of. A corrupt prime, not a lot of health, might still whoop my butt is the only problem. 
My guys didn't take too much damage from that whole situation. So they might be okay. But as we found, again, uh, last episode, these, uh, these corrupted dinosaurs are kind of crazy, uh, kind of deadly, and kind of destructive. So let me just see what we can do to it. I might even be able to just... 1v1 it. Not if we're pooping mid-battle and not if we're getting tag teams, which we're about to. Oh, wow. Uh, yeah, 800 damage. No, 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 no. Not good. Not good. Not good. All right, we're gonna... Am I gonna die here? I'm dead. I'm so dead. I'm so dead. I gotta run. I gotta run. Oh, no. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Oh, no, 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 no. Run! No! Also, he turned into a unique. Hold on. Oh, no. Uh, 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 uh. No. No. Are my guys okay? Whoa! <laughs> oh, I just launched the living daylights out of me. Oh, dang it, man. That was a good one, too. Oh, okay. I don't know when it happened, but that was actually a unique that just died. Oh, gosh. They're targeting my other guys. <gasps> no, no, no. Oh, they're going to kill my other guy. No, they're so dead. They're so dead. They're so dead. We just lost all three, didn't we? No, 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 no. <laughs> okay, wait, are they both dead? It's not too late, it's not too late, it's not too late. We can go, we can go, we can get out of here. We can get out of the home sweet home. Go, no, 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 no. Did he, did I, did I, did I save it? Did I get him out of there or not? <laughs> oh, we fumbled that so badly. That really all went wrong so quick. Oh, I should have known. Dude, corrupted suck. We got the mega out of there. We got him out of there. <laughs> yes. But at what cost? We lost the other two. Oh, you didn't deserve that, my guy. But, uh, well, look. Hey, we got, we got a third mega. I guess that's good news. But still, that actually stings. That actually stings so bad. All right, come over. Come over here, dude. Ah, uh, man. Well, the, the tough part here... Well, actually, do I need to head back out there? I can just do that. I was going to, like, teleport back out there and grab my stuff, but we might not need to do that. Um, we got everything that we kind of need on us. Man, if you were saddled up, I probably could have saved you a little bit better. Um, oh, man, that's... I wasted so many genetic strings on those other two as well. But hey, it's my own doing. I can't even complain. That was all my own silliness that ended us up in that situation. Um, man, Corrupteds. I don't know what to say in the matter. They they go hard. And uh, you know what? Thanks, time we corrupt our new friend here as well. He's a beast already. Let's see where this stat ends up. Let's see where it goes. 1, 3, 62, 17. Damage. 55% damage upgrade. All right, as banged up and damaged as this guy is, I need to go and test this out on something because I feel like he's going to hit like a truck. <laughs> oh, yes. Uh, I think that was a headshot, so it probably isn't like the perfect demonstration. I just realized this guy also isn't imprinted. I might be able to fix that. I might be able to fix that, but no. Why is it this guy that's not imprinted? All right, that's a headshot. That doesn't count. What's going on with this Bronto over here? Hold on. I mean, like, it still deals good damage, but the imprint would be so much better. Or it would be better if it were imprinted, sorry. So what is that in the distance over there? You see that? What is that? Have I been over there before? I haven't. Oh! Mystery island out there. All right, I need to go and... I need to go and head out there and see what's going on. Home sweet home. We'll get all our megas back together. We'll let them do some healing. And I really got to get myself a nanny to see if we can uh, we can sort that out. But come with me, my friend. Because there is some mysterious island out here that doesn't... Like, it, it's not, definitely not on my map. I don't know if I can actually go out there either. That's the other thing. Because some of these, uh, some of these, these far islands seem to be outside of the world border. Which means, I don't know, maybe there's some teleporters to take us out to them. Maybe there's some boss or... Oh! <laughs> okay, then. What am I looking at? Please tell me I can go out there. 
It's totally going to stop me before we get there, though, isn't it? There's... There's... I was going to say they look like dragons and weapons or whatever. What in the world? What is going on here? Okay, this is... Oh, I'm stuck. Is it, there's, there's, there's an invisible wall here. Okay, this is 100% a boss arena. This is 100% a boss arena. But who? But what boss is in there? I, I, I mean, I can only assume. Some sort of dragon wyvern being. How do I get in there? There is... Like, this is meant to be explored. This has to be. I need to explore this thing. It's like a, a temple shrine island of some sort. Whoa. Has this always been here or was this... Did this just appear during like the most recent map update that I... That I installed? Because I don't recall ever looking off our shorelines. Can I see this from my base? Hold on. You kind of can. That definitely wasn't there beforehand, right? I would have seen that. I, I would have seen that. There's no way. There's just no way. <laughs> But then again, I have missed finer details. That that wouldn't be that wouldn't be that surprising. The big question right this second is, do I go and enact revenge? I think I need to. Let's get these two friends. My guys, come over here. My two megas. My two megas that are full health. Not my guy that that's like two shots from dead. Come with me, my friends. We have to go and get some revenge on our prime triceratops that just took down our family and myself we must get our revenge where are you going come over here buddy hey hey follow me follow me come with me my friend what's flapping its wings over there is that another oh a mountain wyvern oh so we got shadow wyverns and we got mountain wyverns that's pretty cool little baby kind of you're just a regular eh, it's a unique all right, take it down. Take it down. This guy must pay. Must pay for his cry. It didn't even do anything wrong. We kind of, we engaged the fight first. Oh, snap, this thing still hits hard. Dude, Corrupteds are just like ridiculous. <laughs> okay. I mean, it is a prime too, so it's, it's got like a lot going for it. But still, what a beast. Get wrecked though. Get absolutely wrecked. Oh, I never stood a chance, man. Never stood a chance. They hurt us too. This guy, what? Look how much damage they took. That was like a, a weak little triceratops. And it still dealt like 7,000 damage to each of my guys here. 7,000, 7,000. That's insane. Okay, there are some worthy opponents out there right now. We didn't get a corrupted string. We did get a prime string though. Uh, I got plenty of prime strings. The corrupted ones would have been better. But beggars can't be choosers. And today, I guess I'm a beggar. But hey, we leave with three megas. Um, we still got a few others. There were these guys over here that are going to need upgrading um, as we go as well. I'm, sure, I'm thinking once we get, I don't know, maybe 10 of these megas. Just a few more than what we've got. Uh, we might be ready to face Kong. But in saying that, um, like, like I, I, I don't even know if that's true. Because... We just got our butt wolves by Triceratops. So what hope are they going to have against a big old Lord Kong? Yeah, I got some I got some thinking and some planning to do, guys. But thanks for watching. We're going to end it here. If you did enjoy the video, please go ahead and punch that thumbs up. But most importantly, have a fantastic day. Bye for now.